So why is it so hard to tell a good idea from a bad idea? So to help us understand that, I want to introduce you to somebody. His name is William Goldman. And if you don't recognize William Goldman, I'm not surprised. He's a Hollywood guy. He's a Hollywood writer. And if you don't recognize the name, perhaps you recognize his work. He wrote The Princess Bride. I'm sure some of you have seen that. For people of my generation, he wrote Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. He wrote the screenplay for All the President's Men. He wrote Marathon Man, Heat, Misery, Magic. Maybe two dozen movies in all. Won two Academy Awards for screenwriting. But ironically, what William Goldman is most famous for writing is just three words. And what he wrote was this. Nobody knows anything. Nobody knows anything. Now, he was talking about Hollywood, and in particular, about the fact that no one has any idea how well a movie's going to do until after it's done it. That you can take A-list stars, a top director, a great script, and end up with a movie like, you know, like Heaven's Gate, which costs $50 million to make, and gross less than two and a half. But on the other hand, you could take complete unknowns, first time director, first time actors, and get a movie like Blair Witch Project, which completed photography for $35,000 and has since grossed more than $250 million worldwide. Nobody knows anything. True in Hollywood, and I believe true in Silicon Valley and anywhere innovations are taking place. I mentioned before, that Netflix was my sixth startup, one of seven I've done altogether. Some very successful, some not so. But I promise you, on the day each of them started, I had no clue which would be which. Because nobody knows anything. Thanks for watching. And if you liked what you saw, I'd love you to subscribe. And if you want to be notified of my future releases, well, you know the drill. Just hit the bell.